Hey Brawlers, Ventus Knight here, back with another official Bakugan unboxing. And today we don't just have one Bakugan starter pack, we have two Bakugan starter packs to unpack, and both of these have something very special about them. The Bakugan Ultra that they include are brand new species of Bakugan. We have Floptor Ultra on the left here, and Trino Ultra on the right here. The Bakugan Starter Pack contains everything that you need to get started in a Bakugan Brawl, so pick one up for yourself, pick one up for a family member or a friend, and you can get right to brawling. These brand new Bakugan Starter Packs are rolling onto store shelves as I speak. So, go check out your local toy retailer and see if you can find it, and if you can't, well, you will very soon, so keep your eyes peeled. The Bakugan Ultra aren't the only attractions here though. Each Bakugan starter pack does include three Bakugan, which means two core Bakugan are included. And right here is the rare Arliss Cubo Core. The other Bakugan are going to remain a mystery for now. So if you have any idea of who they could be, let me know in the comments. Leave a like while you're down there. And also let me know which starter pack you want more. Darkest Clopter Ultra or Ventus Trino Ultra. I really want to see what's up with these brand new Bakugan, so let's get right to it. We're going to start with Darkest Klopdor, because Darkest is a very popular faction with all you brawlers watching. Plus, Klopdor Ultra has a very cool feature that I really want to check out. Let's crack it open and see what awaits. Each Bakugan Starter Pack contains one Bakugan Ultra, two Bakugan Core, six Baku Cores, and some cards that will also assist you in playing. When taking out your Bakugan Ultra, make sure to be very careful of the plastic ties keeping them safe inside the package. If you try and wrestle them out too rough, they might get a little hurt. You can pop clop their Ultra right out, but he is not complete without his beautiful eyeball, which comes out just like a Bakugan Core does. Once he's unpacked, take Klopdor Ultra's eyeball and pop it right into the center of the Bakugan. Take this middle prong here, bend it downwards to open up the hatch that the eyeball goes inside. If you're having trouble, don't worry. Klopdor's not too strict about the orientation of his eyeball. Once it's in there, it's kind of stuck in there. Bend it around however you like, and it's really not going to matter. All that matters is, well, you put the eyeball in the place that it belongs. Klopdor's just kind of chill like that. Klopdor Ultra has some fabulous detail that deserves a nice long look, so let's do a little 360 here. Klopdor Ultra and his beautiful eyeball aren't just for show though. In a feature unique to this guy, Klopdor Ultra has a secret mechanism. When you put it in his eyeball, this little itty bitty tab here sticks out of his left side. If you press down on the tab, it really doesn't take all that much pressure. Boom! His eye goes off flying! Klopdor attacks! It doesn't have any practical effect in a structured brawl, but man, does this thing go flying! Just be careful not to lose it. <laughs> Klopdor Ultra is the star of the show here, but he certainly isn't stealing it. This is a Bakugan starter pack, which means two core Bakugan are included. First up, in his native faction, we have Serpentis Core. This beautiful Leviathan Bakugan is just as terrifying as he is huge. He's used by Shun's evil older brother, Masato, but Serpentis. maybe, maybe he has a bit of good in him. If you're curious about Serpentis, make sure to check out Bakugan Battle Planet's show because we're now streaming on Netflix. The first 26 episodes are now streaming and that means that 52 11 minute parts are available to be watched. But just note that you can only stream it using these services in the United States and Canada for now. He may not appear in Pyrus, but making his recent debut in the show is... Tertonium, the newest addition to Winton's crew. And finally, you've already seen him, but you haven't seen him jump. Klopdor Ultra. In case you're curious, here's a look at the brand new cards that Klopdor Ultra's starter pack comes with from the newest Bakugan TCG set, Age of Arliss. And here's a quick look at the Baku cores they come with. Don't forget that today we've got a double dose of unboxing. We're gonna hop right into this Ventus Trino Ultra starter pack. Trino Ultra is certainly not as complex as Klopdor Ultra, but that'll be good news to a lot of brawlers out there. And plus, I just love this little dino boy, and I know you do too if you've seen him in action. In the Bakugan cartoon, he's just so boiled. I love him. Trino Ultra is a really cool combination of chunky, but also super detailed. His horns are fully articulated. You can pose them however you want. From all the way up to all the way down. Plus, his head is poseable as well. He has this super neat sliding mechanism that makes his head go in and out, and it allows him to stand tall and proud like many other Ultra Bakugan. 
He's got a fantastic combination of sculpted detail and deco application that allow you to see all his scaly details as a giant dinosaur. Well, and rhinoceros. He is Trino, after all. He's easy to fold up, so let's do just that and look at him go. Premiering here in his native faction, we have another brand new Bakugan as a Bakugan core. Vice Rocks. Do you remember when this guy appeared in the Bakugan anime in one of the very first episodes? It's been a really long time, so if you need a refresher, you can check him out on Netflix. For our final Bakugan today, we're taking a look at... Arlos Cubo. It's everyone's favorite core Bakugan and the rare Arlos form. Thanks for watching today, Brawlers. Let me know if you enjoyed today's double starter pack unboxing format. In the comments, tell me, do you want to see us unbox even more Bakugan per video? Would you prefer less and a longer look at just a few Bakugan? Or did you like it perfectly today? This is the Unboxing Goldilocks Zone. Leave a like while you're down there leaving your comments. Make sure to subscribe. And of course, thanks for watching and good luck in your next Bakugan Brawl. In a hand, take a step.